So today we will see how to solve the assignment of expression parser using Bison. So this is the assignment that we have been given and it is a basic arithmetic parser and it actually inputs variables values and performs certain calculation according to syntax given and it's basically a simple parser and works like a calculator like a python prompt it's a very basic basic version of python prompt so first uh, let's see the program first say uh, let's see the question so this is the question so the person must support the following features basic arithmetic operators logical and relational operators parse input line by line must support variables undefined variables must be reported so let's see the uh, yak code so I have done this in bison and so this is the bison code so what I have done is firstly this is the prologue and in the prologue I have defined the global variables and I have taken a basic of seven variables sorry six variables and initialized with undefined and undefined is the highest number and then this is yy error yy lex uh, look up and register so these are the uh, this is the prologue and here we define the functions and uh, import the necessary libraries and then we start the grammar so when we are starting the grammar we will firstly start it by the start command and start symbol and the start symbol will evaluate to either empty or a start symbol or a command and when we are getting a start symbol we will print this for the shell and next the command will expand to the expression and slash n so it will uh, have slash n and slash n means new line so a command will have a certain expression uh, followed by enter or new line and the ASCII value of new line is 10 then we will have expression so relational operator R is the lowest precedence so the lowest precedence will be at the top of the grammar so that during the expansion it will be evaluated at the last so here we define the grammar of expression relational R and this is how bison works so dollar dollar so dollar dollar is the expression this one so dollar dollar will evaluate to dollar one this is dollar one this is dollar two this is dollar three this is dollar four so it will or dollar four so this expression dollar this expression so this is dollar one dollar dollar four uh, or dollar four so or it will be a relational or so dollar dollar equal to dollar one now we can have another thing that is id equal to expression so if we are finding id equal to expression means this condition a equal to 25 so we will store this in a certain variable defined by the id and it is the number converting to ascii and subtracting it from the ASCII character so this will be first one will contain this array's first character will contain A this will contain B this will contain C D E F so we are only supporting uh, six variables here and if it is a uh, stop S then it will exit so if we type S then it will exit now what we will do is we will see the relational R uh, expanding to relational and since or is lower precedent than and the relational and will be not equal to and equal to equal to then it will be lesser precedence with less than less than equal to greater than equal to greater than and this this have the same precedence so here we define the bison expression and then we are having the plus minus and the fa uh, the division multiplication 
and this is the same way what we are defining here this is dollar dollar equal to dollar one dollar two dollar three and this is the variables and the factor will turn to numbers so a digit might be a sequence of numbers yes obviously it is a sequence of numbers so the factor will turn into number and it will be assigning to an ID and now the number will be number or digit so 10 into number plus digit so this will recursively evaluate and generate the grammar and we are uh, defining the syntax for every number here and we are here in, uh, initializing the variables and here we are looking up uh, uh, look up so that if we give something like this C equal to a plus B and then 2 so here if a is defined then we will find the a and we will perform the calculation necessary accordingly and here is the men we will print the dollar for prom shell and this is yy parse and this is written and this is the yy lex so yylex does what it does is if we get we have to take characters right so it will take continuous characters and this is error for reporting the errors so let's run this so for running a bison file we will do bison then test 3 dot y so it is giving two shift reduce conflict but it will work properly and those uh, conflicts are not very much necessary for solving this problem we just need to solve this so the file is generated this file was not there and say this file was not there and this file is generated so let's look at this file get it test 3 tab dot c so this is the bison parser generated it is built by I think Richard Stallman and someone else so both have built it and I will upload this in the description means I will upload the file and give the link in the description so don't worry you will get all this so from the test dot y we are doing this we are gener it has generated this so the main aim of this is to generate the grammar files so that the compilation does automator, uh, automation by itself so it is basically a C code now what we have to do say, and since it is a C code we have to compile this the G++ minus O so let's give it test 3 and test the tab dot C okay fine so there are some warnings but it compiled correctly so test 3 so let's see this a equal to 25 okay firstly a was not defined so a equal to 25 so there will be no blank space in between so a equal to 25 so a equal to 25 okay fine b equal to a star 4 plus a remember this is a very primitive parser with very very limited grammar so if there is a space in between it will treat it as error so b equal to 125 c equal to a plus sorry b and then 2 was equal to 26 d equal to a greater than b or r b greater than c or d equal to 1 equal to f plus 2 so f is undefined but we will assign e value 2 and for s it will stop so we can do one thing here is let's change the grammar test 3 dot y and if it is stopping then print f according to this parser terminated 
Goodbye. Fine. Let's run this. To bison. Okay, fine. Two ships to this conflict. Okay. So A equal to 25. So if you're. To okay, fine. Oh. So firstly, I have given the exit so this will not work so firstly this will print person terminated goodbye then it will exit zero so in this bracket we can execute some C codes normal C codes and so let's give this 255 S okay. So this is the calculator version. It's a basic calculator. So I will be uploading all of these resources. Uh, thanks for watching.